Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm gonna to show you the Smooth Zoom Out tool. So the download link is in the description and once you've downloaded it, all you need to do is save it in your motion templates folder. So go to home, movies, motion templates, uh, transitions and just save it anywhere in there. And then once you've done that, go back to Final Cut and go to your transitions tab and go to wherever you saved it. I've got it in my Smooth, smooth Zooms um, transitions and it's called the Smooth Zoom Out tool. And what you want to do is go ahead and drag that into the middle of the clip that you want to um, use it on. I go into more detail of how to use this in the Smooth Zoom In uh, video that I did a couple of days ago. So if you want to go check that out, I'll put the link in the description. I just go through it a bit in a bit more detail. So once you've dragged the transition into in between your two two shots that you want to transition from, what you want to do is select the transition and then up on the right hand side you'll have the in zoom mount and the out zoom mount. So if you go to the last frame on the first shot, the in zoom amount controls how much it will zoom in and out by and then if you go to the next frame, so the first frame of your next shot, that will control how much that zooms in and out by. And what you want to do is just kind of line the shots up until you've got a smooth zoom. And even before I've lined the shots up, that looks pretty good because it's it's framed quite similar. So once you've sorted out your zoom amounts, what you can do is actually use a transform tool on the clip to line up both shots. So if you select your second shot, hit the transform tool, and then basically just line it up with the shot before. So skip between them both. And a tip for this is if you use your mouse and let's say, let's put the mouse on the door and then you can skip to the frame before and you'll see that the shot needs to go up slightly. And then put your mouse on the door again and there you go, it lines up pretty good. So yeah, it's just a little tip, use your mouse to line up each, each shot. So once you've lined it up, what you want to do is hit the keyframe button and then go to the end of the transition and just move your clip back into center. And once you've done that, to get it even better, you want to bring up the video animation. So right click your clip go to show video animation and then just drag the keyframe the first keyframe before the start of the transition the mid before the middle of the transition and that will just smooth it out a little bit and there you go that's how you use the smooth zoom out transition hope you guys enjoyed it and i'll see you in the next one